Hey everyone, my name is Elvi, aka Glitter Baby Dragon, and in this video I'll be showing you how to make a laptop case like this. And it's made out of all pieces of clothing. Of course, you can also use any type of fabric, what you have laying around in your house. I just prefer to reuse the pieces of clothing that I wasn't wearing anymore. If you follow this tutorial, it's quite easy, I would say. So if you're a beginner, you can definitely follow along. Let me know what you think, and I would love to see your result. Good luck. Get our baby. For this project, you need a sewing machine, fabric and thread of your choice, one button, a small piece of elastic, measuring tape, scissors or a rotary cutter, and a pen and some paper to make the pattern. Start by drawing a rectangle that is slightly bigger than your laptop and add your seam allowance. Cut it out and trace it on the paper, but this time add a triangle on top to make the flap that will close the laptop sleeve. Again, don't forget to add seam allowance. Cut your pieces out and the pattern is done. When you're using old clothes, cut away all the seams like this. Trace the pattern for the front and the back onto the fabric that's going to be outside and then cut it. Also cut out an extra triangle piece for the inside of the flap. Don't forget to add seam allowance at the bottom. It's possible that the pieces of fabric are too small for the pattern. In that case, you can sew multiple pieces of the same fabric together so it will fit the pattern. Sew them together and press them. As you can see, my pieces of fabric were all too small for the pattern, so I had to make many extra seams. I think it's kind of cute though. It adds a little extra character to the item, don't you think? Here's an overview of all the pieces that you need to cut out. The triangle piece needs to be attached to the bottom part first. Do this by facing the two pieces right sides together and stitch them together with a straight line. Now we're going to stitch the three layers together of the envelope piece. Put the fabric for the inside and outside on top of each other, facing right sides together. Add the third piece on top of that. This piece will be on the inside, so it doesn't matter which direction it's facing. Pin everything in place and add the piece of elastic in a loop in between the two pieces of fabric with the outer layer. Make sure the loop itself is in between the two pieces of fabric. Sew all around, but leave one short side open. Cut off the corners and add a zigzag stitch. Turn it inside out and then fold the seam allowance inside and stitch it in place. When the back piece is finished, sew the front pieces together in the same way. Now it's time to attach the front and back piece together. Put the two finished pieces right sides together and put your laptop or tablet in between. Then pin the pieces together. Carefully double check to see if your laptop still fits when it's pinned. It should also have a tiny bit of extra space around the edges. Then sew the pieces together. My fabric was a bit too bulky, so besides the corners, I also cut off the excess pieces of fabric. I then also had to hem them with a zigzag stitch. Put the laptop inside and decide where the button needs to be. Mark this with a dot and hand stitch the button in place. The laptop sleeve is done now. I hope you liked this tutorial and here you can see the finished result. I'm very happy with it and I'm so glad that I was able to make this myself instead of having to buy something new. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Bye bye!